Alright guys, I'm back on track. Um, two days ago the fight was off. Yesterday I got the call, the fight is on. So uh, I had to get to LA to get the medicals done. And I never did it like, you know, never did so much medicals on one day. I did, I did it all today. Like x-rays, EKGs, and MRI, and the blood test, and the eye test, and everything you can imagine I did today. But actually it's pretty good because uh, it helps prevent us fighters from uh, major injuries and that's why MMA doesn't have too much people dying compared to other sports of course. Um, now I got of course, every time I go to LA, I get uh, caught in traffic, and now it's rolling pretty good, but I started, I left the house 5.20 this morning, and we are, it's almost 6 p.m. right now, so uh, yeah, that was my day, I'm trying to get back home, trying to grab something to eat, and get to the gym. So I can at least get one training session in for today, and then I'll take you guys through the trip uh, to Moline. I hope you enjoy all that driving around, flying around stuff, because there's going to be a whole lot of it uh, in this block. We're on our way to the public workouts and it's gonna be fun they moved it from 1.45 to 1 o'clock so we gotta hurry a little bit uh, get Janex with me text him with his uh, lady phone and uh, yeah I'll show you guys what's going on and as I found out there's gonna be a, a second way in uh, during a hockey game I bet you like that too so just stay tuned the room where we were checking in. Oh yeah, that, that. Also yeah. got the mouthpiece. Women yeah, man, represent. I do better. I do. I'm gonna help you. Go sign. I'll be a personal brown slave. <laughs> Always wanted to have one. That's why. There you go. You have one now. Press conference today. I'm uh, gonna start uh, in just a minute and bring up all the competitors that will be fighting on the main card televised on HD Net. Uh, Saturday night, again on HDNet, our new broadcast partner. Before we do, I uh, want to point out the five lovely ladies standing behind me are our five top finalists uh, for our win a spot as a pro elite ring girl. Jeremy Andreas Cronio Tompkins. His opponent, professional fighting record of 29 and 7 from right here in Bettendorf, Iowa, Tim Sylvia. <laughs> and what we'll do real quick uh, before we open up to questions and go to one on ones, I'll go ahead and uh, bring up each competitor individually to say a couple words. Let's welcome back the pit bull, Andre Orlovsky. Thank you, Pro Elite. Thank you, Andreas, for the force of this fight. I'm very excited. I'm ready and good luck with you. Thank you.
some international flair Saturday night again at the uh, Mark live on HDNet. This fighter, 12 wins, 4 losses. Welcome Andreas Kraniotakis. <laughs> the big question is have we been pronouncing your name right this entire time or not? Uh, you did a great job, actually. Um, Thanks for having me guys, uh, that's a great opportunity, I took the fight on short notice and um, that's the call that every fighter uh, waits for, he's, he's hanging out in the gym and uh, getting the call, you can fight one of the big names out there, one of the legends, um, it finally happened to me and um, yeah, I hope I can uh, show you guys what I'm capable of next Saturday and I hope I can make it a good fight and uh, thanks again Pro Elite for the opportunity, thanks for you guys for coming out and um, yeah, I'm definitely enjoying it right now and uh, hopefully I'll go on Saturday too. And a man originally from my home state of Maine now making his home here in Bettendorf, Iowa, Tim Sylvia. You should know that, Andres. I'm so sorry about that. Yeah, you should know that. hockey game and being part of the halftime show. I got to dance, I guess, or strip or anything in between. Strip. Strip, yeah. Okay. There you go. I just want to sheep.
just looks like him. <laughs> all the time, having fun, being at the weigh-ins, being at the uh, fake weigh-ins uh, during the hockey game, as you saw, and um, I just checked my mails again, and I'm so happy for the support I'm getting, so I just uh, thought it was good giving something back, um, I have those wonderful t-shirts you guys saw, with my name on it, on the back, so I will give some of those away. For those of you who represent me the best, um, just uh, yeah, tell uh, brag about me, brag about my fight tomorrow um, on Twitter. Uh, my tag is bdkanyotakis.com or on Facebook. But please um, take my official Facebook uh, Facebook page, Andreas Big Daddy .com, like it, and then put it in your status, and um, I'll choose one from Twitter and one from uh, Facebook and I'm gonna send you one of those t-shirts in your size and um, I'll just let you know you, you post it, you brag about it, I'll let you know who won and um, just one more thing for my German fans um, Auch für euch Jungs uh, gibt es Shirts umsonst und zwar gibt es die ganze G äh, Geschichte auch um, exklusiv für Deutschland, das heißt also einmal aus Deutschland ein äh, Twitter-User und einmal ein Facebook-User aus Deutschland die offizielle Seite benutzen. Andreas Big Daddy Kanitakis liken, einsetzen und ähm, dann gibt es ein T-Shirt. Danke für die Unterstützung. Ähm, ich weiß nicht, ob ich äh, gewinnen werde, ob ich, ob ich verlieren werde morgen. Ich weiß nur, dass ich alles geben werde. Und äh, ich fühle mich großartig, dass äh, ich so viel positives Feedback bekommen habe. Ich habe das Gefühl, die ganze Nation steht hinter mir und äh, die ganze MMA-Szene steht hinter mir. Danke dafür. Und, ähm, um, see you guys. <laughs>